like to add up the total number of points that each team has got. Um, and you'll see that team names are repeated in here. Um, and so in here I'm going to need to have like away points, uh, home points, and total points. And so to start with I'm going to assess the number of um, away games that they want. So that one there is home and that one there is away. Um, and so what I need to do is I need to use a formula called sum if. Um, and this has got three um, arguments. The first one is the range. Um, if you don't know what a formula does, you can just click on the formula and it will bring up help. It takes a little while and it will tell you what each of the things do. So the range of the cells you want to evaluate. So that means the, um, the range of which you want to look into and to say some. So I basically want to add up the values in this column if the away team name is Manchester United. So the range of cells I wish to evaluate um, here is actually this area here. Um, the criteria is um, if it equals this value here and the sum range, as in the range that I want to add up, is this value here. And I'm expecting Manchester United, where the names are, to have zero points at this point. Click enter and it says zero. Now, I also want to make sure that that formula stays in the same place. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to put dollar signs, but I'm actually going to put dollar signs on the column and row of all of the values except for H3 because H3 is the one that's going to change as it drags down. Click enter and let's have a look. And that would be about right. So Shrewsbury Town have beaten um, Liverpool and Manchester and hence have six points. That's correct. And I want to do the same for the home points. So that's equals sum if brackets, but this, I'm not adding up this one, I'm actually evaluating evaluating this area I'm, the criteria is that it's Manchester United and the area to add up is this area here click brackets, then click enter so it says that Manchester United has scored no points at home let's have a look at that, Man U 0 Manchester United 0 there we go um, and again, I need to add the absolute cell references in, so I'm going to pop in some dollar signs to make sure that as I copy replicate this formula, the um, ranges don't change, but the um, criteria range does. And then I'm going to work out the total points. I'm going to equal that one plus that one. Enter and then drag that down. Now one thing you might want to do is you may want to extend your formulas down the page um, so you can add in new games as they arrive and the way that I've set up these columns isn't actually very good because it means that all of this area is going to be evaluated and actually I just want um, I want just the column to be evaluated in the same case here I'd like the column to be evaluated so that so in order to put in a whole column you will simply put f colon f and that means a range of the of a single column colon f and then enter and, and that should work so let's have a look yeah and that stayed exactly the same and I need to do the same for that one A colon A, and this one here, and that's E colon E. And actually, in that case, I also don't need to do the um, absolute cell referencing, um, and I can drag that in. And that means that now, if I add extra games to the bottom, they'll be added in to the total score. So I hope that's been useful, and uh, you can take that away and improve your spreadsheets um, for your league table.